when I talk about breaking down the barriers associated with, with big data, I think people are afraid of big data. They don't know how to deal with it. They don't think they have the processing power available to them to deal with big data. What we showed them today and what we're showing at SAS is we are now allowing them to break down those barriers by introducing a high performance analytic platform that takes away the concern. You no longer have to deal with how big is the data. Let's start dealing with what we can do with that data to solve business problems. Well, today there's a big difference between business intelligence and advanced analytics. A lot of people are doing BI. And BI is great in looking at past activity, showing graphs associated with past activity. But what if you want to look into the future? What if you want to take that same data, stop just looking at what happened in the past, but start looking at what's probable in the future? That's where analytics come into play. That's where SaaS comes into play. And that's what we want to provide folks is a platform by which they can predict uh, future outcomes of key attributes of the organization. And when people talk about the democratization of data or the democratization of analytics, I think they're on the right track. Analytics and data used to be reserved uh, for a select few in an organization. As we commit to fact-based decision-making cultures, we have to be able to provide a, a various uh, uh, types of tools so we can handle different types of users in the organization. Everything along the continuum from simple query and reporting all the way up to advanced modeling. Things like visual analytics allow people to look at large amounts of data and look at potential patterns that they possibly should explore further. When you talk about advanced analytics, uh, one of the big differences, advanced analytics um, deal with surfacing previously unforeseen patterns in data. If you're working just in BI and you're working with past data or you're working with OLAP, which is about defined dimensions, how can you possibly come up with surfacing previously undefined patterns in data? That's what analytics is all about. It's about exploration and it's about discovery and it's about those discoveries making a big difference in, in your business. Yeah, if we look at uh, high performance analytics and we look at uh, uh, visual analytics, you know, there are two different things. The high performance analytic engine or the, or the laser engine is, is helping us to discover information via visual analytics. Visual analytics look at large amounts of data in a visual way, look at variables being correlated, things that we should look at further. If we look at high performance analytics, we're, we're getting more into dealing with modeling to help support prescript, prescriptive activities in an organization. So models, the result of a, of a customer model may be, this is how I treat the person next time they hit my website, or this is how I should deal with them the next time they hit my uh, call center. So visual analytics start discovering uh, if you look at HPA and those procedures, model quickly so that when they contact you, you can deal with them appropriately.